Dearborn STEM Academy held their annual science fair on January 24th. Students from all grades presented their projects to guests, staff, and their fellow students. Some students presented their findings on whether or not the price of bread affects the amount of time it takes for the bread to mold. Another student named Mizora showed us how she programmed an autonomous car. The reason why I did this is so we can learn how our future generation cars are going to work, so how we can get an insight on how the sensors help the car move and navigate. She did this using software on her computer. This is Mindstorm's E, which is okay. one of the company's cars. Legos, okay. which is which um, allows most of the you know robot battles that you may see on the internet. <laughs> okay, okay. Is that involves Legos? This is one of the companies that provides it. Okay. So then this is the coding that the Mindstorm uses. Another student named Major presented his findings on how soda affects the color of eggs. His reasoning for choosing this topic? I wanted to test like three variables that are close to the same. So instead of choosing like different drinks like milk, um, coffee, and maybe like juice, I try to use variables that are around the same. So they would see which sodas would be more healthier for your teeth. Did you know that there were more than one kind of slime? These three Dearborn STEM Academy students explain why you shouldn't use borax in your slime. Slime, like, it, sometimes it can be dangerous, like doctors, they talk about it sometimes. It was in an article that doctors said that um, children should be, yeah, children should be safe with slime because something that's in a lot of slimes is borax, and borax, when you have it in your hand for a long time, um, it can like burn your hand, like burn your skin. So they had an article about that, and we just wanted to like put it in here and make it. Slime is not bad, but it also is kind of dangerous. Like the Students worked hard on the projects, and it showed in their presentations.